Welcome to a wild, wacky Thor News Weather Watch. And you know what? I thought around the 20th we would notice an uptick and things getting crazier. And now let's look at this map. Do you want to focus upon the Gulf and the Caribbean? Or do you want to focus on the straight line that is blowing up over the four corners? Or do you want to focus on what is pushing in through the Northwest? It is raining in a lot of places right now. It's right. You get a big storm moving through Oregon. It is the one place Antifa is. <laughs> like the one place in the whole world. I'm so scared of them. I just peed my pants. No, so you got rain coming in. Is that Des Moines? Do we have a state named Des Moines? It's news to me. Why does it look like Des Moines? All right, hold on. Whoa, dude. Did I get Mandela affected? Because I used to think that was Iowa. Now we named it. it I'm in some weird timeline where it's... Okay, so Des Moines. <laughs> you got rain in Denver. New Mexico. Arkansas, Missouri. I mean, you got rain in a lot of places, man. Florida's been getting a whole lot of rain. And look at those guys down in that Cuba. They're Chantal. Okay. But, you know, one thing that's kind of neat is I'm kind of weird and obsessive about the most beautiful women on the planet. And I keep a crush list of like 10 of the most beautiful, talented, smart ladies. One of them, her name is Katya. She's like Lois Lane. Anyway, she lives in New York. The storm is passing over her right now, probably. I think she lives in Brooklyn. And I'm not too creepy about it. I got a lot of crushes, so... You know, I spread all my love across the ten of them. All right, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah, but like... Over half of them watch my show. So that's neat. And I try to be funny. Everybody likes funny. Okay, so Albany, you had a big major storm moving through in Massachusetts. It's coming towards Boston, although it could go north into the Manchester and Nashua, you know. And August, looks like you're getting some. And my last name is Lewison, and there's my first name is T. So it's like they stuck me in my own last name. That is so weird. Things are weird. Oh, I got other stuff to talk about. This is a look at my projected love life. Projected love life over the next seven weeks. I'm very excited. Now there's an awkward silence. Let us look at this together as Mother Nature pulses up and down. So yeah, um, the real active part of the hurricane season is usually September. And late August, and then into October. And I wouldn't be surprised if the seasons are kind of all fungled up. Someone mentioned in the comments the other day, the hurricane nasty part may start late and go late. And that sounds like a fair assessment. Definitely think we'll be seeing activity until the end of October. But, yeah, whatever's going down in the Gulf, it is worth watching. And over by the Caribbean, I mean, that thing looks like it's moving backwards, doesn't it? Or back asswards, as we like to say around here. You know, I like to check my videos after I posted them to make sure I didn't say anything too stupid. And I realized today, hey, I really like the sound of my own voice. Is that okay? Sometimes people have been like, he likes the sound of his own voice. Like, that makes it sound bad, you know? Like, that's, like, I should not be doing that. Like, hey, stop liking the sound of your own voice. Okay. Now, remember, this is the system that I thought would develop. And then now we're here, and none of the models are showing it. I'm still watching it like the hawk that I've been watching it like. And I got to take it now because I, I don't think it's going to develop, but I could be wrong. 
about being right, and then I'd be right again, and it could develop, you know? I'm just saying that with everything going on, I mean, look at that thing, and look at the whole system. It looks like the whole gulf is trying to uh, sit and spin. And so, yeah, that looks like a freaking monster, man. So wouldn't, wouldn't it be crazy if the models totally got it wrong, and they're like, oh, yeah, by the way, it's developing. And then I'd be like, oh, okay, I was right. But then wrong and then right. I don't know. I'm watching this thing. I ain't falling for no banana in the tailpipe. That's what she said. I want you guys to know that I love you and I appreciate you. And you are making the cockles of my heart tingle. Yeah, so we got that dang thing we were watching over here. And I'm watching this, even though it's unofficial. But what about this would make somebody be like, yeah, no big deal. I mean, it could be no big deal, but I'm just saying. It could get hurricane by the very end of August. Or it could get hurricane in two or three days. We are watching. I'm not guaranteeing no hurricanes. The only thing I'm guaranteeing is that I will probably think about women's brains way too much. Whew, that was a save. Mari, hi, please help me give this some attention. My country is slowly dying. Pray for the Amazons. Yeah, man. Things are changing all over and seemingly like they're kind of falling apart. Uh, it would be a great time for all people to work together and get along. That would be wonderful. And I wanted to say again, there's a storm, I keep putting out a warning for a storm, a storm system that will start on the 27th. Oh, that's not the symbol I wanted. So it'll start on the 27th, and it, it'll be part of this monster system. And it has a chance to be a really big, bad storm. Just look how freaking huge, I mean, I am the rain man of rain bands. And look at how, there's your mushroom head. Gross. Look at that thing is just. It's got like a hammerhead shark. Cyclonic hurricane at the front. And then it's got its little dragon body. And then it's got a giant scorpion tail. So that is definitely the most impressive rain band I've ever seen. It, But it's weird. It's got that one high here. See the two highs? Here's our monster Azores high. And then our backup high behind it. It's crazy days, man. So John Home Duck. Huge shelf cloud approaching New York City. Tons of lightning. You're welcome. Hey, the Goldman Sachs building's lights are still on. Here you go. I'm sneaking in some real science. Puget sound seismic tremor has begun. Tremor event. All right, I'm looking for my lighter. This is definitely smoking if you got a minute. Okay, I can't find it. I'll have to wait. Yeah, so the semis annual slow slip event means dozens of tremors under Puget Sound and a slightly higher risk of a Cascadia mega quake especially with the gas giants on the same side um, but much higher risk for the next two years and six years Reed Timmer Mamamptis over Evergreen Colorado from persistent storm on the eastern slope of Mount Evans greenage filter applied it's almost like, that's why, it, it's not just boobs that are great. It's the whole woman that makes the boobs great. Because if you just, like, the sky, it looks like just a sky, a, a sky of boobs. And without the eyes and the hips and the hands and the and the brain, it means nothing. James Spann, severe storms blowing through New York this afternoon. Pretty ominous skies looking north for Petworth. Capital weather. And a big old rainbow popping over Manhattan. I bet at the end of the rainbow, Katya is there. She's worth more than a million pots of gold. Uh, and I snuck, snuck in some economic data on you. While the minutes stress data dependency, we continue to believe the darkening global picture will prompt another easing in September, with more possibly to come. Yeah, 
um, and especially with the trade war going on, that makes things weaker when everybody's fighting over everything all the time and nobody's working together. It is crazy. We've had a quick change in the tropics, so in case you missed it, here's what's up, Florida. Put an emoji names in there. Corporate CEOs are worried that when the next recession breaks out, revolution might too. And part of it is that's what like one half is like, hey man, I'm getting ready for the civil war and when everything breaks, I'm prepping for the end of the world. So you don't prep for that shit, man. Dude, avoid it. Let's all work together. Wonderful. Accurano explains why this is the time of year typically active. I'll have to watch that. Stay positive about romance, y'all. And it really, 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 really pisses me off that Sony and Disney can't work it out. So Sony's taking Spider-Man back from the Marvel Universe. What a horrible mistake. I might even make a whole video. But seriously, Selena, Emma, or Amelia. Those are just three of the ten. Yeah, man, so remember things can get crazy. It only takes it a short amount of time. And I'm looking for something. Venus remains in hiding, but you can't miss the waning moon. Venus creeps into the evening sky while the moon shows off at sunrise. Yeah, I'm doing this thing when I'm walking 10,000 steps a day. Oh, I got a giggle for you. How to distract an Egyptian god. There you go. She's got a cute butt. <sighs> Some people are going to see, I don't know. I'm trying to tell jokes, man. I'm trying to tell those jokes. And I'm looking for something. Wow, I guess really everybody is into astrology now. Sagittarius A, MDC, bringing the jokes. Oh, yeah. The president today was like, I'm the chosen one. I was like, that was me, man. But either way, as long as we get to the thousand years of peace, I'm cool with it. All right. So it's going to be a bit stormy. Oh, let's do some model runs. Everybody loves the model runs. All right, here we go. Then I was going to do the flashy thing. Yeah, so that's that giant rain band. But notice how these two fronts, look at that. Okay. If you say it in a tweet, it's... <laughs> All right. So this is the 27th. So it's like when the two different fronts combined. Oh, man. Right there. That is the 27th. And that's going to be a lot of concentrated rain. And then it gets to that. We're starting to see red show back up in the rainfall totals. As we get closer to the Neptune alignment in September and Eris in October. We will definitely be seeing more weird wild weather. So that big storm. And actually it took some of the rain out. But I'm just saying I think it's going to be worse than that. And I still think it's going to be a really bad storm around the 27th. And that's what I'm standing by. Ooh, what else? How many minutes? I'll just do another one. Who am I talking to? Yeah, there's your thumbnail right there. And that's without any development of rainfall over the next seven days. And you can see that North Carolina is getting wet, heavy rain. South Carolina is getting some heavy rain. Whatever these Des Moines and the Nebraska plus the Florida. The Alabama, Mississippi, Tennessee. A lot of places will be getting some heavy rains over the next week. Yeah, we'll definitely be staring at this situation all night long. Yeah, the lightning is pretty popping. I'll repeat that again in case I said it kind of stupid. The lightning is kind of popping. 45,000 strikes. In the last 48 hours. Look at that flying bee, man. I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. Yeah, it's very lightning-y. And that is definitely a big flying bee. All right, so it's been fun. I hope you learned something. I love you. And I'm rubbing your butt on the astral plane right now. But in a very non-sexual way. I got that from friends. In a very non-sexual way. And I didn't get all of it from friends. What am I talking about? I don't know. Well, I told you it's going to be a wild, wacky update. So, everybody stay cool. I'll probably be talking to you in the near future. Peace out.
God bless everyone. May the force be with you always. Let us live long and prosper together. And now it's time to hit that button. And the button means play. Go out and have some fun. Stay and have some fun. Just have some fun.